sweet treat battles. So, first off, this is where home habitat advantage goes out the window, and we have specialized habitats. Secondly, we only have four battles to recap. That means more time for art at the end. <laughs> This battle's random habitat is... Savannah Woodland! More specifically, the Okavango Delta of Botswana. The mantis shrimp lands in a slightly salty puddle, which is good. <laughs> Unfortunately, the wild dog and his pack are chasing a lechery, and the dog tramples through the puddle and squishes the mantis shrimp. The wild dog wins the rainbow collection division and is on to the final roar. Deep underwater, a flying squid found itself caught between the epic sperm whale and the epic giant squid. A battle ensued. The whale swallowed the flying squid and began to chase the giant squid when the March Camel Magic Portal opened and swept them both into the Tidewater Glacier Habitat of Alaska. The squid squirted a cloud of black ink. The whale swam into the ink just as a ship went by, striking the whale. Alakablaya! The epic whale is gone. The epic squid survives. <laughs> the great white shark can reach lengths of up to 20.5 stoats, while the northern elephant seal can reach almost equally impressive lengths of 14.7 stoats. Hey kids, Carl the Bat's back with you and I'm flying high above the North Pacific, which happens to be the Pelagic Realm Habitat. Ha <laughs> ha! And here's the elephant seal diving for some tasty calamari. Uh-oh. And here comes the great white shark and boy is she hungry. She is zeroed in on the seal and bitten it. <coughs> The water below is churning and the seal's trying to twist around and claw at the shark, but it looks like that shark is really tearing off some chunks, not to get too graphic with you. It looks like the shark's gonna have seal for dinner tonight and go on to the final roar. This battle's random habitat is Peatland. The skua and the cob were transported to a bog near the Irish Sea. The skua immediately spotted an Irish hare and dove at it. You know, I'm starting to think skuas are kind of obnoxious. <laughs> anyway, the cop felt nervous out here alone. He spotted some fallow deer close by. A quick note. You may have noticed that we have misidentified the cob. We have also misidentified the pronghorn. Previously, we have misidentified elk, moose, and probably many others. We rodents are bad with ungulates. They are big, they have hooves, they have antlers, most of them. We regret the errors, but we will probably repeat them. Thank you. It began to trot toward him, but then the cob began sinking into the bog. He struggled mightily, but he only sank deeper and deeper. Help me. The skua just sat and watched, eating the rabbit as the cob and the last of the bear's head fungi disappeared into the peat. <sighs> the skua wins. The final roar has been decided. Which division will reign supreme? Who knows? I am MC Marmot. Thank you for watching.